Being a scientist, I must check, check to make sure my experiments are in order. So let me check. Let's see. These are. Let's see. I have my pork chops. Every single door is there. There's my chicken. Yep, got my steak. Hey, where's the beef? Where did I put that beef? Oh, it's nowhere in my inventory. Oh, that's not beef. That's not beef. That's not beef. Oh, where's the beef? Oh, beef, beef, where are you, beef? What up, you internets? This is uh, GT Miner, and I'm standing behind my invention from Clyde Wood Chance Meatballs. And here I have my faithful tech subject, Wolfie. Hi, everybody. I'm going to be with GT the Miner showing you his invention. Hooray! And by hooray, I mean who cares? Okay, you just sit there. So, um, I, I plan to remove these legs to the invention, but for now, that's just the way it is. So, um, you probably remember this from Clay Wolf with a Chance of Meatballs, and I don't know the name, it's like something, something, something. Now, let me just uh, slip on to this armor. Now, I've realized in my first video, I didn't show you what my avatar looked like. And I'm sure many of you are thinking I'm a noob or something, so that's my skin. I do have a s texture pack, and yeah, I actually made it. It's a custom one. It's called Super Steve, and uh, here's the uh, beef be from my uh, intro um, wh where is that beef dispen dispenser uh, yeah here it is so this vi video may make you hungry one sec time set zero All right so now I so now that I've shown you the invention itself I'm going to show you um, the how it works so um, because it's the main food in Minecraft, I'm gonna show you a pork chop and sprint over there ASAP before something before the food over mutates. So it says pork chop. Oh wait. Oh no, wait, that's a glitch. Uh, why does this have to happen when we're making a video? Okay. So, um, take two, and I mean that as a figure of speech. Right, so, I'm, I'm gonna run ASAP. The biker's going. Oh, great, the creeper spawned. Right, so as you can see, it, it makes the food item, and in, unless you're super quick with buttons and sprinting, it the food will over mutate almost instantly. Now this isn't an exact thing to the movie, be because the food takes a little while to over mutate. But um, yeah. Now um, I wanted to put water just like the movie, but the problem is I'm in a n snow biome and snow plus I mean water plus snow equals ice. So yeah. So this is basically how it works so you pre press a button and it sends a signal over to say well when it, wherever the food is stored and then it'll have a command block that sits, uh, that says whatever the food item is followed by a dispenser that I mean a, a dropper uh, yeah a dropper which shoots at the food and then it lands directly onto that pre pressure plate oh phew I almost thought I'd activate it and that pressure plate um and that pressure plate um activates this powered rails which sends the minecart down here up up over here over to there where the redstone powers all the way up here to the dropper where I I mean yeah, the dropper where I had creeper spawn eggs. So, so um, Wolfie, can you please explain the formula that goes into this? Sure. Right, is that that the redstone forces the item out, dropping it onto the pressure plate, making a molecular structure, and blah blah. Science, you know how blah blah blah. 
Right, so you heard it from Wolfie, that's how it works. And I even got the orange stuff. And basically I'm just stalling it because the video because seriously, this took way way shorter than I expected it to be. So I just wanna keep this video running as long as possible. So, um yeah, that's scary well and yeah, I guess that's everything. It's my video my video. Oh and oh and you know there is one thing other thing I want to show you now. Um, th now you're probably wondering, even though I, my intro explained it all, what my what the flint I'm <coughs> well the machine stores and it stores beef, steak, chicken, and pork chop. And yeah, that's my video. And that's about it. Thank you for watching. And see you guys later. So, um, Wolfie, can you please explain the formula that goes into this? Sure, the mass times acceleration equals the force of electric light forcing the food. Wait, um, I didn't do that in my Wolfie impression. Oh, God.